Hey everyone, it's Erin. I'm um, sorry I haven't put up a video for a few days. Um, I was really busy um, the last couple days and it was my birthday yesterday. Um, so I'm going to be putting up a birthday haul within the next few days, but I haven't gotten all of the gifts um, that I'm going to be getting yet. I haven't gotten everything from my parents and I haven't gotten everything from my in-laws yet. So I'll be putting that up in a few days. Um, today I'm going to be putting up a top 10 products under $10. So I found this really helpful. I found a few people that did a few beauty gurus on YouTube that did this video already and I find it really helpful because as I'm showing you these products that are under $10, they're products that I've already used so it's kind of like a review at the same time so you guys can know like what these products are like and plus they're very inexpensive so that's also a really good thing. So I'm just going to go ahead and start into it. So the first thing I have is actually by Lush. This is the Karma Shampoo Bar. Now this, with tax, is probably over $10. It is definitely over $10. It's like $9.95, but it's pretty close. So this is what it looks like. It's like a green in color, and it's a lemongrass scent is what the Karma is. If I can get it popped out here for you guys. This is what it looks like. And if you guys looked at this, you would think that I've never used it before, but I've actually used it probably like 10 times. Um, on the bottom of the can when I first bought it, it said that it was good for up to 80 washes. So if you think about it, you're spending $10 on this, but it's going to be good for 80 washes, and I believe that too. Um, it's, a, it's an amazing shampoo bar. It has a really, really good lather, really good scent, and the scent stays on your hair. It smells amazing. The second thing I have, this is a new bottle. I haven't opened it yet, but I've been using this Avon Moisture Effects Hydra um, Eye Makeup Remover. I think since I was like in ninth grade, something like that, like when I first started wearing makeup. So, um, yeah, it's it's a really good product. It's by Avon. It's very inexpensive. I think at full price it's two ninety nine, but they have sales where it's like ninety nine cents, and the bottle lasts a really long time. So all you need to do is put a little bit on some Kleenex and then yeah just rub off your makeup and it works really really well it doesn't sting or anything like that it's a really light scent then the third thing I have this is almost gone I bought this probably about two months ago this is a new product by Johnson's this is the honey apple body wash and this is 446 at Walmart you can get it for that price there it's probably more expensive at other stores so it was four dollars and forty six cents this scent smells, I don't really smell the honey, it definitely smells like apple. It's a really light scent though, it's really moisturizing and the scent stays on your skin. I definitely recommend this, it's a really good product. And then, the fourth thing that I have, this is by Mark Cosmetics, sorry about the little mark there guys, I've had this for quite a while. This is the Mark Powder Buff. Um, powder and it's in nude skin. I've had this for quite a while, like I said, so it looks kind of scuffed up. So that's what it looks like. And it originally came with like a little powder puff thing that you would put like the makeup on with, but I just use um, a foundation brush to put it on with. It's a really good product. It's really exp inexpensive. Mark Cosmetics is a great brand. I think this was somewhere around $6.99. So that's a really good powder. Then I have I have another product, another eye makeup remover product. I just started using these recently, and this is just a small sample pack, just so you guys can see what it looks like. And this is by Prevens, I think is how you pronounce it. They're makeup remover wipes in this bag. They are there's 15 of them. They have vitamin E in them, and you, it's just like a little. I'll show you what one of them looks like, and it's just a little wipe. So instead of putting cream like on a Kleenex, all you need to do is just put this and rub it on your eye and your makeup comes off. It doesn't sting. There's no like perfumes or anything in it like that. And um, I find too sometimes these tend to dry up after you've had them for a while, but all you have to do is run them under some water and they work just as good as when you first got them. And this was $2.99 for this pack. So I definitely recommend those. And then... I have a few makeup products here. So this is the Revlon Colorstay Eye Crayon. So this is an eyeliner. And this is somewhere around $8.99 for this product. I've been using this Revlon eyeliner for, I'd say, five months now. It's the best eyeliner I've ever used. Some people don't like to pay a lot, and I don't like to pay a lot for eyeliners. 
$8.99 is a little bit expensive because there are definitely eyeliners that are cheaper, but this stays on all day. And this is what it looks like because it's a little, um, oh, sorry guys, it's a little crayon. It's not a pencil. So yeah, it stays on really well. And this is in the color brown. So that's what the crayon looks like. And then I have a product from the Body Shop. And this is the Shea Body Butter. And I'll just open it up so you guys can see what it looks like. It's what the cream looks like. I've been using this for a while, as you guys can tell. It has such a good scent. So this is from Body Shop. Like I said, this is $8 for the small size. It's a little bit more for the big size. But Body Shop is really, really good quality. So $8 for this, and it lasts a really long time. It's very moisturizing. The scent is amazing. So like, I like the Shea Butter, but I mean, any of the body butters in the small size that are their $8, they're amazing. Like, I have other types as well, but this would be my favorite of the body butters that I have. And then I have another makeup product for you guys. And this is by Revlon. I've been using this for quite a while now. This is by Fabulash. It's Growlicious, it's called. Really good mascara. And that's what the wand looks like. Well, you guys can see it. There we go. There. Okay, so this is, I paid $8.99 for this. I'm not sure, like it probably just depends on where you buy it, but $8.99 I paid for this at Walmart. It's a really good mascara, I definitely recommend it. Um, I know Jessica Biel did um, an advertisement for this, and that's why I ended up going up and buying it. But it's actually a really good mascara. And I have two more things. This is by Luberderm. This is just a lotion. I definitely recommend Luberdern if you're just looking for a really good moisturizing lotion. This is actually in Shea Butter as well. I actually really like this scent. My husband actually bought this, which is funny, but I mean everyone needs to have cream or have lotion. So just Shea Butter, it's a really good moisturizing lotion. This was, I think, $8 he paid for it, but it's a really big pump. It's got a pump on it. It's a really big bottle, and we've had this for, I'd say, at least six months. So that's that. And then the last thing I have is also from Avon. My mom bought this for me last Easter, and it's from Avon as well, and it's by Footworks, um, their foot like care. Um, this is, it says, refresh hot summer feet with this non-greasy cooling foot lotion that contains juicy watermelon extract, absorbs quickly to moisturize your feet, and leaves a light, fresh feeling on your skin. I love to put this on my feet because I'm a nurse and I'm in sneakers all day. My feet are like sweaty and really sore by the end of the day. So this is really good to put on. It just really moisturizes your feet. The scent is really light, so it's not like too overpowering or anything like that. And like it says, it's not greasy and it's pink, pink in color. So that's what it looks like. There we go. So those are the top 10 products that I have that I've chosen out of like my beauty products that I have. Um, if you guys have any questions, just leave a comment or send a video response. Um, I'm probably going to be doing another video um, later on tonight, um, just where I have some time tonight. I'm going to be working for the next few days. So I hope you guys enjoyed this, and I hope it was helpful, and I'll see you guys really soon.